Okay, so we have a cone here up in the scales. A few important things to remember. Her four feet are on the scales. She doesn't have her head out through the side of the crush. She's not leaning up on anything. As you can see here on the clock, she's going up at 700 kilos. This red light the indicator just indicates that the weight is locked in. So as you can see, once she gets back off the scales, the weight drops down. We just put her up in the scales there again. So the weight goes back up to 702. And the red light just indicates that the weight, she settled on the crush, on the platform, sorry. Four lights on it. So that was weighed. Okay, so we have the cows done. Uh, eight cows have just been weighed. We're now going to weigh their eight calves. One thing to note with the platform, the crush, when you're weighing smaller animals is you can afford to keep it a little bit closer to the front. And that just prevents the animal from stepping off the front of the platform. If you leave too much room at the front, the animal will be inclined to put their two front legs over the front edge. Obviously weanlings are a little bit more difficult to weigh because they're smaller, tend to be a little bit more fidgety, and therefore they have a little bit more room to move on top of the platform. So the less space you give them in front to go forward. So we have a group of eight uh, sucker calves here. These were all born last August, September. So August, September 2018. We're now in April 2019, so these are all aged between 5 and 8 months, or 150 and 250 days. And that's the optimum age range to weigh a suckler calf. So the, the purpose of weighing suckler calves is to get a good estimation of the dam's milking ability. And it's that weight between 5 and 8 months which gives the best indication as to the dam's, the dam's milking ability. So we're going to go ahead and weigh the calves now. 